Okay, it's another cold and rainy night. So guess what I'm doing? Yep, I am uh, food reviewing uh, food trucks. And I am trying out this uh, Chinese and Thai hot food one tonight. I'll let y'all know what it's, what it's like. <laughs> okay, so I am back and uh, it's a cold rainy night and I'm doing a food review on the uh, food trucks here in Fayetteville. And I stopped at the Chinese, Chinese and Thai hot food truck and I ordered shrimp and broccoli. So anyway, it comes, comes kind, of, kind of looks like a uh, beef broccoli, but it's shrimp and broccoli and it comes with fried rice. And that's all you get right there. This uh, this meal cost me ten dollars and six cents. So <laughs> I hope this is good. I hope it's better than what it looks. <laughs> so anyway, I'm gonna dig right on again. I'm gonna try to give it a shot here. Um, I don't see but two, maybe three pieces of shrimp. <laughs> so a little piece of shrimp. Get some broccoli. Give it a try. Hmm. Not sure. Um, the broccoli is a little mushy. It feels like it's been sitting out for a little bit. Um, it's not real hot. It's warm, but it's not real hot. Um, I don't know. Let me try some of the rice. Let me see what that's like. No, I don't care for the rice. Rice isn't good at all. Um... I'm gonna eat a little bit more of this. Maybe I'll get, I'll get a, a different vibe off of it or <laughs> whatever you wanna call it. But uh, so far, I'm, I'm not liking it much. But uh, I'll get back with y'all and give you my, my review on it. Be right back. Okay, after uh, eating a little bit of this, uh, I did find that there's quite a bit of shrimp in the uh, shrimp and broccoli. And uh, the shrimp and broccoli, was okay. It wasn't terrible, but it wasn't great. Um, the rice was terrible. Uh, <laughs> it was cold. Uh, it needed either salt on it or soy sauce or something to, to give it a little salty flavor. Um, but yeah, it, it had quite a bit of shrimp in it, a lot more than the uh, first Chinese uh, truck that I tried. I don't remember the name of it. Um, uh, homong or something like that, <laughs> but uh, uh, yeah, I don't think I would order uh this dish again from the from the the Chinese um hot foods. Uh, but my my rating on this, I think, uh, man, like I said, the rice was terrible. It was cold. Um, I think. Uh, oh man, I wouldn't go more than a four out of 10 on this dish. Uh, some of their other dishes may be better. I don't know. Like I said, it's just the, on this dish that I, I had tonight. <laughs> it's not good. Don't order this dish. <laughs> uh, but anyway, I got, oh, looks like about three or four more trucks I need to try out. I'll get back with y'all on all of them. Bye y'all. Place to go tonight. We'll try out another food truck.
back at uh, Kimberly Soul Food and I am trying a new dish of theirs. Uh, I am gonna be doing the fried ribs. I know the last time I was here, uh, oh man, they has, what did I try last time I was here? I don't remember. <laughs> um, anyway, I know it was very delicious. Uh, I, you know, it was the cabbage and the wings is what I had. And they were super, super good. And this is the Kenley's Soul Food food truck. Y'all come on out here and try them. They're out here in Fayetteville, right behind uh, Lake Fayetteville. <laughs> All right, welcome back everybody. So uh, I am, I'm doing reviews on the food trucks again tonight, but <clears throat> I like the Kenley's Soul Food so much. I stopped there first and got me a dinner. Anyway, they had three dinners on special. They had fried ribs, uh, it came with uh, baked beans and uh, greens <clears throat> and with a either a roll or a cornbread. They also had, um, I think it was a shrimp gumbo. And uh, and they also had a burger basket that was, came with a burger and some uh, chicken wings. Anyway, I st went with the fried ribs because I, have, I don't think I've ever ate fried ribs before. It's always been, you know, grilled or smoked or whatever, you know, so... Anyway, that's what I got tonight. You got the ribs, you got baked beans, and you got greens. So anyway, let me show y'all what I got there. And the greens look like they may have came out of can. They're probably not, probably not fresh out of the garden, but hey, I still like greens, so it really don't matter. Anyway, I uh, got my cornbread and my ribs. I think I'm gonna try a rib real quick. They look pretty meaty, so. Mm are hot, <laughs> very hot. Not too bad though. A lot of meat on the rib. Oh, I'm gonna try it one more bite. <laughs> yeah, I like the rib. Mm -hmm. So I'm gonna give a taste test on the rib, or beans here. Hmm. <laughs> the beans nice like I have, has a little bit of hammer meat in it. I'm not sure. Um, but they're not bad. They're they're really good. I like that. Alright, I'm gonna try the greens. I know the last time I got uh, cabbage from them, the cabbage needed a lot of salt and pepper, so I'm kinda Almost betting that the greens will also. Mm. The greens, whoo, I don't need salt. Wow, holy moly. <laughs> oh, well, good lord, those are salty. Woo, doggy. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to go back and talk to that woman. <laughs> Cut back on the salt a little bit. Uh, but yeah, you can, you can definitely tell that they're out of the can. They're not fresh out of the garden by no means. Uh, but they're still, I mean, if they, I think if they didn't have so much salt on them, they'd be really, really good. Um, but yeah, since they got a lot of salt on them, yeah, I'm not crazy about them. But anyway, I want to uh, finish eating this. I may get a different pr perspective on uh, everything. And uh, I'll get back with y'all on my final review. All right, welcome back everybody. So here is my final review. You ready for this? <laughs> okay, but I was I want to kind of clarify something here. Um, on your meals, uh, you do get two sides. Um, they they recommend uh, recommend or what they suggest. Anyway, it comes with two sides, and they had uh, um, baked beans and and potato salad. Well, they were out of potato salad, so I got to choose the greens. But you can also choose eat you know both your sides so you don't have to go with what they have on the menu anyway with that being said that was, that was the two sides that I chose for tonight for this meal so if you really want to get your cholesterol up tonight 
go to Kenley's. <laughs> they were super salty. Everything was super salty. Um, the ribs, they were good, but they were salty. Um, I think this is my first time ever having fried ribs. I think I'd rather have them uh, grilled, smoked, whatever you want to do to them. Uh, I don't think I'll do fried ribs again <laughs> unless they were non-salty. Uh, the cornbread uh, is the jiffy sweet cornbread I don't like. Uh, and I know their rolls are also the sweet rolls. I don't like sweet rolls. Uh, the baked beans, uh, they had a bit of meat in it. I think they had, you know, had a little more barbecue, barbecue sauce in there than I, than I like. So I'm not a big fan of barbecue sauce. Um, I think, uh, kind of like ribs or, you know, stuff like that is, <clears throat> is like your steak. If it's made right and it's good, you don't need all that extra sauce. So, and the greens, oh my God. What, what can I say about the greens? They were terrible. I've never, I've never met a terrible green. <laughs> these were good. These weren't good at all. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Kennedy, but they, they're not good. <laughs> so, I think out of this uh, meal, my favorite part was the ribs. But like I said, they were super salty. Uh, man, I think on the ribs, I, I want to score these individually because you can choose your sides so you know you may want something different so anyway i will choose the ribs uh i will give them i'll give the ribs a four uh the cornbread i don't like it I, it's just my personal preference you know i know everybody's taste buds are different and everything but for me cornbread a two just cause I don't like sweet stuff. Um, the baked beans, uh, for me, it had too much barbecue sauce in it. Uh, it was a little over salty. Uh, I'm gonna give that one a three. And as far as the greens, oh my God, they were definitely out of can. They were way over salted. It had more salt than it had greens in there. <laughs> Uh, I, I had like two bites of it. That's all I could eat of it. It was, it was I won't give out a negative 10, <laughs> minus 10 on the greens. <laughs> but like I said, now I've ate at Kimberly's before. I have, I've had their turnip greens and I've had their, uh, chicken, uh, the, the, or I'm sorry, not turnip greens, cabbage. I meant cabbage. I've had their cabbage. The cabbage was a 10 out of 10 by far. That, that was probably the best I've had there. Uh, their wings were, uh, I think I gave them an 8 out of 10, but they're, honestly, they're probably a 10 out of 10. Uh, the purple whole peas, oh my God, so good. Uh, I gave them a 10 out of 10 on that. Uh, now, I have had their mashed potatoes. Their the mashed potatoes were pretty watered down, pretty runny. Um, yeah, I think I gave them like a 2 on that one also, on the mashed potatoes. So, like I said, anyway, uh, Go, try, go check out Chiquilis. I've had some great food from there. Um, and I'm trying something different every single time. That's why I do these food ratings. To kind of let y'all know what to order and what not to order, right? <laughs> oh, I forgot to mention, uh, these meals come with either a Kool-Aid or a sweet tea. And I decided to go with Kool-Aid. And all they have is this blue one. So, so they normally do the red, but all they have is blue this time, so... Mm. Ah, Kool-Aid needs more sugar. <laughs> I like a lot of sugar in my Kool-Aid. That I do like sweet. Uh, yeah, let me try another drink. It'll kind of stir it around a little bit. Yeah, I think I, I used to love Kool-Aid when I was a kid. Um, but that's still not too bad. I, man, Kool-Aid, I'll give about probably a three on them so uh anyway i might try the sweet tea next time it may be different <laughs> but anyway see y'all next time bye y'all uh yeah i hate to give kennedy's a bad rating because they they do have some good food there and and the lady working in there she works hard and she's super nice so i, I really hate giving her a bad rating but so go check them out they'll appreciate your business
Bye, y'all.